Hey everybody. The other day I did a water change in my wife's tank and I took a bucket full of water that had a bunch of water sprite floating in it and I stuck it outside after I dumped another bucket out and I completely forgot to bring it back inside. So now I have got a bucket of ice with water sprite floating under it, sort of frozen into it. And so we are going to find out if water sprite can survive freezing temperatures. I'm going to go ahead and bring this bucket inside and we're going to let it warm up and we're going to see what happens whether or not that water sprite survives. So stay tuned and we will find out. All right, it has been four days now and so far, as far as I can tell, everything looks fine. These pieces right up here on top are the ones that were actually frozen into the ice and they still look perfectly good. Now you can see some of the grungy stuff on there. Uh, maybe a little bit of that dark coloration is the cyanobacteria. That's why it got thrown in this bucket in the first place. I need to get it uh, treated and then I'll have either plenty of lace leaf java fern, I'm sorry, lace leaf water sprite for sale or I will have plenty of it to put in my other tanks. And in putting it in this bucket, I just set it outside, as I had mentioned the other day, I believe, and it wound up being forgotten and got frozen. But everything in there seems to look fine. So there you go. Water Sprite can withstand freezing temperatures, at least overnight, uh, for a day or two. And it still seems to be okay. So make sure you're subscribed, and you won't miss anything I've got coming up. And then don't forget, of course, I do sell my plant so you can check my email down below and contact me if you're interested in that so thanks again i'll see you real soon in the next one